Want to see how I stretch? <laughs> Not like that. Hi everyone, I'm Sylvana from Sylvana Kicks. And welcome to today's video where I'm gonna show you my go-to stretching routine the short version of what I do before I do any type of workout or any of my intense training sessions. This gets me stretched and ready to go almost immediately. Let's get started. All right, so I generally tend to start with my leg raises. So what I mean by leg raises, if you haven't seen it in any of my prior videos, it's just when my leg goes straight up and down. And we're just warming up the legs for now to get them ready for more of my like static stretches that I do later on. So I generally do around like three or five each leg and then I just keep switching until I feel warm. So I start with those front ones and then I'll hop right into my side as well. So side, my legs are just straight off to the side when I throw it. And normally my hip pops like that if you heard that. So that's pretty, <laughs> that happens like almost every time I start. Doesn't hurt, just literally pops, which is like kind of funny. So I'll do the same thing for my side. And then I'll do the same thing for my crescents. So full range, just warming up my legs for, like I said, the static stretches. So quickly go through these. And then I'll hop into a groin stretch. So from here, separate the feet, go down, push the knees back. So I'll sit really deep into this pushing the knees back, feel it along the groin and my outer hip. I'll hold this for around like 30 seconds or so. Sometimes I'll rock as well, go a little bit back and forth, just to get deeper into the stretch a little bit. Hold, hold, hold. This gets me ready for my center split. But before I hop into my splits, I'll go into a dragon stretch, what we call it. So keeping my feet flat, I go deeper into a stretch this way, trying to keep feet flat, back as straight as possible. Again, maybe like 15 to 30 second hold, and then transition to the other side. Keeping the feet flat, back tall, hold that stretch. Then I'll go back into the middle, push back one more time. Again, a little bit of movement or I'll just hold static before going into my split. So that's kind of where like my legs feel a bit warmer now. So they feel ready to do a full split. So let's see how it goes. Hands down and into the splits. So I'll start with my feet flat in the split, down to the elbows, and I'll normally hold this until like it doesn't hurt <laughs> and I don't feel as big of a stretch. And I'll just sit here for a little bit, contemplate life, figure out what I want to train, and then switch to side split. So I sit back, I'll turn, Extend the legs. Lay down on it. Try and get my chest as close to my leg as possible and head down. And I'll do the same thing off the other side. So switching. Extend the legs. Body down, head down. Hold that for around 30 seconds as well for me. Back to center. And then I'll do all of those splits as many times as I need to until I feel like fully stretched and feel good about the stretches and like not as stiff. I rock a little bit when I'm doing my split. And then I'll come up. The last one I'll do on the ground is for my hamstring. So feet will be together. Happy back, so that means straight back. 
and reach forward. So from here, reach forward, pull down. And I'll hold that for as long as I need to. This for me personally is the hardest stretch. Fun fact about me is that this is my hardest stretch to get. So right in the hamstrings and calves, I'll pull, relax, shake that out. And like I said, I'll do it as many times as I need to until I'm feeling a little bit more relief, release in that bottom of my leg there. And then I have one more go-to before I get into my exercises. So from side kick position, I will extend and pull up. As far as it could go, and probably farther than that, I'll hold that for maybe 15 seconds. Back down first, then pull it in, and then down. I'll do that both sides. Do that again as many times as I need to until I feel like a good stretch has happened. And then I'd go right into my workout. You're still here? Well, since you're looking for more content, I do have a ton of stretches on my Patreon page. Go check it out, leave a comment below. Bye everyone, see you next week. A little snippet into my life into my training routine, into my stretching, into my basic stretching. I don't know what to call it. Comment below.